Hey there lovelies, my name is Mamta and welcome to my channel Geek Glitz in which I talk about all things geek and all things glitz. I make all sorts of videos, mainly Harry Potter, so feel free to browse through my channel to check out some of my past videos and make sure to hit that subscribe button if you like what you see. So today I've got a very special video because I am doing a Harry Potter holiday gift guide video in which I will show you all kinds of items that would make great presents for any Potterheads in your life. Now this has become an annual thing for me on my channel because for the last two years I have done Harry Potter gift guide videos. So I'm going to link to both of those videos in my description below if you wanted to check out some of my past videos because honestly some of the companies that I've mentioned in my past videos also have new products this year. But for today's video it's going to be a mix of things because I'm going to be talking about some newer brands that have Harry Potter collections that have been released in the past year too. So this video is kind of of taking a look at all kinds of Harry Potter items across various brands and companies that have been released in the past year. And as always, I will have links in my description for everything I'm talking about today, as well as prices popping up as I talk about them. So let me go ahead and get started. So first up, I'm going to be talking about some books and I'm starting off with the Harry Potter in the Chamber of Secrets Mina Lima edition. So they did a Philosopher's Stone edition last year, which was gorgeous. And this is basically for Chamber of Secrets, it's a similar book. So it's got illustrations and there's interactive elements and it's just a fabulous collector's item. I think once their entire collection is released of all the books in this style, it's going to be amazing to look at on a bookshelf. So I'd highly recommend this item for any Potterhead. And if you want to purchase it with a signed book plate, you can get it from the Mina Lima website. Or if you want to save a few bucks, you can shop around and look at a couple of stores. I'm sure Amazon has it for a couple of bucks cheaper, as well as Barnes & Noble if you're in the States, or Costco if you're in the UK. And next, I'd like to recommend the Harry Potter A Magical Yearbook, which is illustrated by Jim Kay. Now, Jim Kay has done illustrated versions of the books Sorcerer's Stone all the way to Goblet of Fire from the past couple of years. But this year, there was a magical yearbook that was released. And basically, it comprises of illustrations across the Harry Potter world and meaningful quotes and memories from the books too. So there's a special memory or quote for each day throughout the year, 365 days of a year. So you know how they say an apple a day keeps a doctor away? In this case, in this book, we're looking at some Potter a day keeps the Dementors away. So I think it would be a great idea for a present and it's definitely on my wish list. And next, I'd like to talk about Inside Editions. Now, Inside Editions is a great brand that always comes out with various Harry Potter tie-in books and products every year. And this year, I've taken a look at their catalog and it's outstanding. But one of the things I love most from the releases this year is this Harry Potter Feasts and Festivities book. It is amazing. It's full of ideas to throw a Harry Potter party and different types of Harry Potter parties like a movie night, a wedding, a Yule Ball themed Christmas party. So it comes with craft ideas, decoration ideas, as well as recipes and so much more. And this book is available in two sets, like a standard set and a deluxe set. And both of them come with the book as well as some other items that would help you throw your party. I think it's a great gift idea for a crafty potter head or one who likes to host potter parties. And next, let me tell you about Thunder Bay Press. Now this company releases a bunch of Harry Potter tie-in books and products as well, a lot of creative themed ones. So they've got like a Harry Potter embroidery kit as well as a paper model book in which you can create paper models of different uh, locations and things from the Harry Potter universe. And they've got this awesome Harry Potter hand lettering book, which I think is super creative because it's got a guide on how to write magical quotes. So it's actually very therapeutic. I've used it a couple of times and I find it really fun and I think it would make a great gift idea. So another great gift idea is Harry Potter stationery. And this year, I think Cine Replicas has come out with some fun items that would make great stationery gifts. So they've got a Marauder's Map themed notebook, which is great because it's a notebook. But what's cool about it is that there is a Marauder's Map replica inside this notebook. So you can take it out and it's the perfect size. So it's smaller than the Noble Collection Marauders map, but it's still super detailed. And honestly, I find it the perfect size. Cine Replicas also has some awesome wand pens, which I think would make great stocking fillers. And it's basically a pen, but it looks like a wand. So I've got the Dumbledore one, the Elder one, 
Harry Potter one and Snape's one here, and they're all functional as pens, which I think is so cool. And next, I'd like to recommend this Harry Potter photo album and scrapbook by Conquest Journals. And I think this is a great idea for a gift. It's basically a book, a scrapbook, and inside there are pages that have like layouts in them in which there are space for photos to put in, as well as lines where you can put in your own text to describe your own Potter adventures. There's also a bunch of stickers in here, and I just think it's very cool because the book itself looks like the book that Hagrid gave to Harry, like the photo album Hagrid gave to Harry at the end of the first film that had his parents' photos in it. So it's a great nod to the films, it's a great replica in a way, and it's a great way to put in your own Potter memories in here. Conquest Journals also has a great planner for 2022 that would make a great gift, as well as a bunch of stickers that I think would make great stocking stuffers. And next, Fanatic is a great company that makes awesome Harry Potter collectible items. They've got a bunch of Harry Potter medallions which I think are gorgeous. But this year, I'd like to recommend their Harry Potter US book cover art prints, which I think are so cool. So these book prints are available for any of the first seven books from Sorcerer's Stone all the way to Deathly Hallows. They are hand numbered, limited edition, and they come with a certificate of authenticity. And next, I think Harry Potter clothing is always a great gift idea. So Marks and Spencer and H&M both have some fantastic Harry Potter kids ranges this year. And for adults, you can always go for websites such as Box Lunch, Hot Topic, Torrid, uh, EMP UK, and Zavi for some awesome clothing options. So speaking of wearables, another great gift idea is a Harry Potter handbag. So over here, I've got a tote from the Vera Bradley Harry Potter Forbidden Force print collection. So this is a great tote. I've been using it almost every day. It's one of my favorite bags that I own, and I own a lot of Harry Potter bags. And Vera Bradley has a whole range of different bag options. So you don't have to go for something this big if you don't want to. They have smaller bag options as well. And if you don't want to go for a bag, this Hedwig coin pouch, which works as a bag charm, would make an amazing gift as well because it would work with any bag that a person already has. Another great wearable idea is Harry Potter jewelry. And Pandora has a new Harry Potter collection out this year which comprises of a couple of new charms as well as the cutest golden snitch stud earrings. I'd also highly recommend their winged key pendant because it's a stunning piece and would make such a great addition for any Pandora lover that's also into Harry Potter. So let's talk about some toys and games. I think a Harry Potter board game would make a great gift idea and one of my particular favorites from this year is the Harry Potter Pictionary Air Game which looks so cool. So it's basically a wand that you could use to draw in the air and it magically shows up on your screen. It's a great game for a family. And for a Potter trivia enthusiast, the Harry Potter Ultimate Movie Quiz Game would make a great gift because it's basically a box set that contains 400 different cards with questions from all eight movies. And as you may know, Lego always makes some great Harry Potter sets, and this year they've got a couple of new ones. One of the ones I love best is the Attack on the Burrow set. And next, I'd like to talk about Spin Master, which is a company that has a great range of Harry Potter toys. So they've got a little Hedwig plush that can move around and make noises, as well as a sorting hat that could do the same as well. And then they've got a Hogwarts play set in which you have mini Harry Potter figurines that you can move around the play set. So it's kind of like a dollhouse. So next, let me tell you about Cat Kidston, which is a company that has some great clothing and homeware items. So they've released a new Harry Potter collection this year, which has some really fun Harry Potter themed prints. So they've got some great kids clothing options, as well as homeware options. My particular favorites are the Hogwarts house themed mugs, as well as the plates and bowls. And for a Potterhead that loves to cook, Le Creuset has an awesome new Harry Potter range. So they've got some fantastic Dutch ovens that look incredible. Though these do come with a hefty price tag. So I'm going to recommend a couple of mid-range items from their collection. I think their wand spatula set is awesome. I had to pick one up for myself because I thought it looked so cool with all the handles being different wands. And the Hogwarts house themed pot holder from their collection would also make a fantastic gift for anyone who loves to bake. So what I'm thrilled about this year is that Swarovski has come out with a Harry Potter collection as well. So they've got four new figures in their collection this year. And one of the ones that I happen to get, which I think would make a great gift, is this 
little Hedwig figure, which looks incredible. She's holding a Hogwarts letter and she's perched on some books. They also have a golden snitch ornament that looks super cute. So next, I'd like to recommend an awesome product by Rose Shire Co. So they've come out with some Hogwarts house themed preserved roses, which is such a great gift idea. So the box that it comes in in itself is such a wonderful collector's piece. Just look at that huge Hogwarts metal crest in the center. I'm in awe of it. And when you open it up, you could see the preserved roses inside. So I have the Ravenclaw roses here. And since they're preserved, they last one to two years. And in the center, it includes a Hogwarts house themed metal badge as well. And these are available for all the different houses. And next, Royal Selinger is a company based in Malaysia that is known for its pewter items and pewter replicas, and they have a Harry Potter range. So I picked up their Hogwarts castle in this range because I think it looks amazing. It's such a great collector's piece, and it's definitely a statement piece that stands out on a shelf. Now, what I liked about this particular piece is that it's a music box too. So when you open it up, it plays Hedwig's theme. Now Hallmark always makes some wonderful products and I love their Harry Potter ornament range. So they've got this sorting hat ornament this year, which is so cool because you can put batteries in it and you can press a button and then the sorting hat actually moves and can sort you into the different houses. They've also got the Goblet of Fire book ornament out this year, which looks so cool. I love this entire range of ornaments that they've done based on each of the books, and Goblet of Fire was the latest one in their range. And I think the itty bitty plushes from Hallmark would make some great stocking stuffers because they're so adorable and cute. They've got a whole bunch of Harry Potter characters available in itty bitty plush form. And this year, one of my favorite ones that they've released is the Professor Lockhart one because I just love the hair on this plush. And Pottery Barn Teen always comes out with some great Harry Potter products every year. I love their homeware range, but I also really love their ornaments. So they've got this golden egg light up ornament this year, which looks so cute, as well as some Hogwarts house themed frame ornaments. And now finally, let me talk about some Wizarding World items from the Harry Potter shop. So they've got a new Christmas range, which includes some Yule Ball glasses, which I think look amazing. They've also got some pajama sets, which would make some great gifts. And I think a Potterhead would always appreciate some wands. So I think the celebration series of wands that the Harry Potter shop has, has a great range of wands for different Hogwarts houses and for Hogwarts itself. So I've got the Hogwarts architecture wand here, for example, as well as the Ravenclaw diadem wand, but they've got other wands for the different houses, which I think would make great collector's gifts. And then lastly, I think it goes without saying, but if you have access to any of the official Harry Potter shops, they've got exclusive items that would make great Potter gifts for any Potterhead in your life, no matter where they are located in the world. So I mean, if you have access to Harry Potter New York store or the WB Studio Tour back in the UK, the Platform 9 and 3 Quarter Shop, any of the Cursed Child merch, as well as the Universal theme parks. They've got exclusive items that any Potterhead would love. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this Harry Potter gift guide for 2021. It's always one of my favorite videos to put together, this holiday gift guide, because I just love talking about all the different Harry Potter merch that's out there. So let me know below in the comments if any of these items are on your holiday wish list, because I'd love to know. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and please subscribe to my channel Geek Glitz for more things geek and more things glitz. And make sure to hit that notification bell to be informed when my new videos are up. And feel free to connect with me on any of my social media. I've got them listed down in the description. I've got a Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So come say hello as I love to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching, lovelies. See you in the next video. Bye.